We're on our way to Cedar Breaks this morning. We're gonna go up and see. I think that there's too much snow up there still, but we'll go check it out and see. to the summit, 9,910 feet. No paddling up your creek. No paddle up your creek, yeah, that's true. Oh, that's pretty awesome. We're gonna go outside and look at this in a minute. But this is from inside the visitor center at Cedar Breaks. Isn't that gorgeous? We're gonna take the trail to the lookout point supreme. 10,350 feet elevation. Gosh, I'm sure that this isn't going to show up just how beautiful this is. The amphitheater here, it says that it's three miles wide and 10,000 feet in elevation. This is the Chessman Ridge Overlook, 10,460 feet. It's over two miles high here at this point. Rambling, do you want to join the two mile high club? The two mile high club. <laughs> <laughs> I, can't, I can't take him anywhere. <laughs> Just behave yourself. <laughs> We also drove to Panguitch Lake. It's a 13 mile drive off the main road through Cedar Breaks National Monument. And that's also really pretty. As you can see, the lake was pretty high when we were here. I don't think that this fence and everything was supposed to be out in the water. So we're in Bryant Head. This is like combination of like hail and sleet maybe coming down at the end of June. The drive through the park was a seven and a half mile scenic drive and it is really really pretty. There's four overlooks here in the park and I would suggest stopping at each and every one of them because they all have a different view and they are gorgeous. In the visitor's guide, it said that the Southern Paiute Indians used to call this whole area Umapwich, which meant area where the rocks are sliding down all the time. I thought that was kind of interesting. Later on, the early settlers misidentified the uh, juniper trees as cedar trees, and so they named this area Cedar Breaks, but all uh, of the area is covered in juniper trees. We're 
We've had a variety of weather in uh, Cedar Breaks here today in Utah. We had rain, hail, sleet, came across all kinds of snow on the ground still, and uh, just a really beautiful area up here. But we are on our way out, so we'll catch up with you guys down the road. Bye, guys.